Hey, what's up? It's your boy, 24-7 here with 24-7 Fusion Media. Shit. With a number of accounts uh, that we can go through of different kind of sexual assaults being done by different actors and people in Hollywood. Now, we have this. An Oscar-winning director has been arrested for sexual assault. Well, let's see. Which one? Oscar winning director and screenwriter Paul Haggis has been detained in Italy for allegations of sexual assault against a young woman. The news comes from the Associated Press, quoting the Italian news media that have been reported on the case. There is currently no information on where Haggis is being detained or for how long he'll be in custody as Italian authorities investigate the incident further. So now we have an Oscar winning director that's currently up to no good. Paul Haggis was in Italy for a film festival. The alleged incident, according to the prosecutor's reports, details that a young woman in the town of Brindisi was forced to have non-consexual sexual relations over the course of two days. The young woman was also forced to seek medical care following the incident and she was left at the airport by a man despite her precarious physical and psychological conditions. The complaint was formalized by the woman today. Currently, there are no statements from Paul Haggis or his attorney. Wow. It's coming from the Daily Beast. Wow. Oscar winning director and screenwriter Paul Haggis was arrested in Italy on Sunday after a foreign woman claimed he had held her in his hotel room and forced her to have sex over the course of two days. Police confirmed to the daily beast yeah and that's your uh that's your perpetrator right there wow it's fucked up man paul Haggis is best known for his work on the films crash million dollar baby and letters from iwo jima he is also known for his work on the screenplay for the bond film casino royale Haggis was nominated for the Best Adaptive Screenplay Oscar in 2005 for Million Dollar Baby, which was directed by Clint Eastwood. Haggis would go on to win two Oscars the following year for Crash, walking away with the Best Picture and Best Original Screenplay Oscars. Haggis also directed Crash, which earned him a Best Director's nomination. Letters from Iwo Jima also nominated for Best Original Screenplay in 2007. So, yeah shit he got the oscars and all kinds of shit behind him he was doing good work it's pretty fucked up man that uh a lot of people that have solid careers doing good shit in hollywood have real fucked up backstories when you actually look into who they really are it's fucking disappointing but that's just the way hollywood is Haggis worked for many years in television before making the jump to features. One of his most prominent projects was Walker, Texas Ranger, which he co-created with Christopher Kanan and Lisa Grief. His most recent writing project was a reboot of Walker, Texas Ranger, titled Walker, that stars Supernatural's Jared uh, Petalinki. Paul Haggis currently has two projects in the works. The first is Ranger's Apprentice, which he directs and co-writes with Alyssa Sullivan. The film is currently in the pre-production stages. Ranger's Apprentice is based on a novel series by John Flanagan and tells the story of an orphan named Will who was taken as an apprentice by a ranger named Holt. Haggis' other project is The Juliet and is still in the early development stages. The Juliet tells the story of a playboy and an android combining and is based on a short story by Alfred Bester called Fondly Fahrenheit. Susan Weiss directs and Haggis is set to co-write the screenplay with Ian Shore. At this point, it's unclear if the allegations against Paul Haggis will be affecting these upcoming projects. This will probably be determined as the case develops and if Haggis is cleared or convicted of the charges against him. Since Haggis was detained by Italian authorities today, the story is still in very early development more news of the alleged incident likely to be released soon all right so wow we have another creep from hollywood getting caught in italy shit ain't no telling what kind of laws they got over there for this kind of shit 
wow did he just think that uh since he was in another country he can get away with this shit like i said the good thing is he got caught and hopefully if there were other people that he's ever uh caused harm to whether in italy or in hollywood hopefully folks will start coming forward if this is the kind of individual that he is that means that this isn't his first go around so like i said we'll find out more the same way we found more about ezra miller we'll find more about this guy and uh hopefully soon but like i say you guys let me know what you think about this in the comment section below are you shocked to find out that this oscar winning director and screenwriter got caught up in italy forcing a a woman against her will holding her hostage for two days while doing all kind of things to her like i said you guys let me know what you think about this in the comment section below please share like and subscribe if you haven't already it's your boy 24 7 here with 24 7 fusion media and i'm out peace